Hi everyone, we're playing Warframe and we're here to do the Wave Rider and we're going to unlock page 5. So let's head back to Orb Velus. Alright. So let's jump on the pipe. The first thing we need to do is um, get a 20 second uh, trick chain happening. So we can do that with our uh, lovely new technique where we can switch back on the pipe and go back in the other direction. So hold down the space bar at the end. Boost up and jump around. And go back the other way. We we'll just keep doing this until we get our 20 second chain. It also allows us to dial up whatever score we want on the trick chain. We we'll just keep going back and forth. Alright, keep the trick chain alive for 20 seconds. Thinking about it. Okay, let's take a look. So we need to do the tail spinger. Five of those, which is a left click with S, followed by a space. Pretty easy, this one. Easy. Roki's gonna lose it when she hears this. Okay. So we've got to earn 2,000 points for K Drive Trick Chain. So using the pipe turning trick, we can uh, do this pretty easily. Just go into the uh, grindy. Hold the space bar down, do a big boost at the end, and turn around. And we'll throw in some tricks as well, so we can get some multipliers happening. Oop, fell off. <laughs> Let's try again. Throw in a few tricks and try and get some multipliers. Do some front side rollouts. The front side rollouts always tend to increase the um, multiplier. So see, I've got over 3,000 now, nearly 4,000. Got over 5,000. 6,000. Well over 10,000. Of course, you know, the score is capped at 3,000. You can't get any higher than that. Terminal Glinty! Kicking it for Roki, you is! So we've got our first um, 10 times multiplier as well. And we've got the 2,000 point. Do another one. Front side rollout. Hold and boost and head back the other way. Back into the grindy. More front side rollouts. 
turn around. So we've got our 11 time multiplier, so we're heading up to 2,000 points. Side rollouts. So run seven times, nine times, thirteen times. So we're well over two thousand. at the end. Front side rollouts. Get ready for another boost. Seven times. Front side rollout. Nine times. Oop. Didn't quite get ten times that time. Fell off too soon. again. Oops. Oops. So we got a seven time multiplier. Nine times. No, didn't get the ten times. I jumped off too early. Let's try again. Space bar to boost. Throw in some front side rollouts. Five times. Boost, turn around, seven times. Front side rollouts, nine times. Big boost, eleven times. So we're good for close to three thousand there. So we're just going to do one more. Front side rollouts. Oh, fell off. <laughs> Let's go back to the start. Brandy. Front side rollout. Brandy. Boost. Turn around. Roll out. We're on five times. Now we're on seven times. Nine times. One more turn. Eleven times. So we're well over two thousand. Just like your rally, riding fancy. Getting chills thinking about it. Okay, guys, that's the 10 time multiplier challenge. What else have we got? So, we've just got the Event Kids K Drive race. So, I'll probably head back down to the spaceport down the bottom here. That one seems to score quite highly.
Here he is. Bomb the spaceport. I oh. say go, you ignore it. Time kicks off once you hit that first marker. Ready? Gonna kill these guys first. There we go. Okay, let's go. First marker gone. Bye bye. Now we've got to remember to do our boost over this uh, gap here. Space bar boost. Oh, just missed it. Oh, at least we didn't uh, miss the rock completely. Get a boost onto this mushroom. Just a small boost. Jump over this ramp, get a bit of a speed boost. Hey! And through to the finish. So nearly 3,800. Time's up, Kittlywinks. You can still save your home and fix young Roki. Augmenters are standing by. Just transmit the unlocked Graphica. Does he sound angry? I think he sounds angry. Okay, so we're done now, so we can leave. Okay, let's talk to the uh, device here. Uh, wait! Fifth page. <coughs> Grav lifters, what do you think you're doing? Get away! <coughs> no! Stop! An object that weighs nothing can be shot a very, very long distance. I suppose he must have come down somewhere. Hope it was the sea. Otherwise, he'd probably have made quite a crater. <laughs> Yoreli must be out there somewhere too. Wherever she is, I hope she's riding fast and free. I still dream of water, and I wonder if sometimes she dreams of me. Okay, that's the end of the story. Six pages, just a picture of Yorelli. Finish. Can't believe you gone and did it, Glinty. Gave us her story. You know, Roki always said it'd be trouble the day I started thinking. If Neff wants that Graphica so bad, he can have it. <laughs> Come by the vents. Got something you might want to see. Okay, let's go back to Fortuna, to the vent kids. Deals off! Something spooked my buyer, and now I'm stuck with a useless graphica I can't sell. Fortunately for me, the same buyer who was interested in purchasing a controlling share of the rental rights to your vents. You piss rats are her problem now. And as for your broken little friend, might I suggest selling her parts as salvage? You'll need the credits to pay your new landlady. All right, such a nice guy. Let's go inside. Check it. 
Her conduit's lighting up. Roki's awake. Let's talk to Boone. Roki's awake. <clears throat> Boone? Oh, I had wild dreams, fam. Wiped out. <clears throat> then <gasps> Yureli was there. She took me all across the valleys. Boone, there's something I gotta tell you. It's done. Me and Glinty, we stuffed Neff's deal. I sussed out exactly who his mystery buyer on Deimos was. Big Granny Blue was so happy to get a copy of Wave Rider 1 that she sent back some weird elixir for you, Roki. Sparked your neuro conduit back to life in seconds it did. And guess what? She owns the vents now! We never have to worry about being turfed out of here ever again. <laughs> now, prepare yourself, sis. The fams got together and bashed you a new plank. Yeah, took them a minute. But those cheese brains realized you was just trying to keep us all away from Neff and his deals. Fams lucky to have you, sis. You too, Glinty. You're straight logical. Okay. Think kids standing. Fourteen thousand four hundred. Okay. Oh, hello, dear. What a pity that all Nathaniel's money could not buy him a morsel of taste nor a crumb of conscience. A man with the morals of a creeping scab, and just between the two of us, not a patch on the man his father was. One hates to do business of any kind with his sort. But you must understand, dear, that an old friend's life was at stake. Imagine failing to recognize the beauty of Wave Rider 1, thinking of it as low, commoner art, seeing it only as a source of cash. What do you suppose he might have said if he'd known that there was something quite unexpected concealed in those pages? Well, more someone than something, if I'm being honest with you. This is for you, Tenno, the very, very old friend of mine I mentioned before, finally located. Bring her to life, if you'd be so kind. I think my young tenants on Fortuna would like to meet her. Okay, so we've got the Yareli blueprint now. So the mysterious buyer of the vents was the grandmother, Entrati, from Deimos. Got a Noggle statue and a few other bits. And we've completed the Wave Rider quest, which is very cool. So the next thing we need to do is actually build the uh, Yareli. So that'll be in our next episode. So uh, now we can leave the vent. So thanks for watching guys, I hope you like this series so far and uh, we'll see you in the next one. Bye for now.